behind closed doors, behind closed doors, we all see what happens, what happens. Hey guys, name's Fen playing some behind closed doors, this time, oh, oh pardon, whoa. Rude. This time, I'm once again going to try doing some stuff I was suggested, except that all the stuff I was suggested is pretty far back, so I'm not ever going to do it ever. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Needs to I carve out something with that CNC machine. Machinery gets very hot. Do not operate with safety. Laser guard cast. Control panel to pour molten metal, pour complete pour it, and then to spray metal with cold water. <laughs> oh, trained in its use. Uh, well, do I have anything that could be construed as a mold or a cast or anything? Got cotton mm. wool. I probably have to use this cotton wool to stuff up the bells themselves, is what I'm figuring. And I got that note saying, like, punch in the time of day. Thing is, I don't know. Where am I? I don't know if if I'm supposed to like figure out how many work hours in the day are there just by that, or if I'm supposed to ooh, um, find another note that tells me that exact thing or what, or if I'm just supposed to say, well, I don't know, eight hours a day or something. So, no, the builder's work never ceases. It's 25 hours a day by bankers rounding. Anyhow. Wow, I wasn't actually- ah! HA! <laughs> that was a good one, Strombad. That was a good one. Alright, oh. Yeah, but oh my god, look at that, right? Look at that. LOOK AT IT! Thank you. Just, just beautiful. And the music. Also, halaps. Okay. So, hey guys, there's a mine of some kind over here, which I really should have seen, but didn't. Now. Is someone there? I do, cause blurp. So I'll have to be on the lookout. Hey, you look like me, but with gold fingers and hands. Thank you. <laughs> ah, was that indeed? You're never gonna know, son. Cause it, oh, are these live mine? No, they're just mine mines. Well, you don't have a mold though. I guess it's <laughs> I severely hold up. I just realized that's actually hilarious. Look at all this furniture. Oh my god. Oh, 800 hours. Enough is enough. People are disappearing. People are being murdered. And not just Riff Raff either. Those of good strong bloodlines. Well, not Tarquin Vermilion the Third. Today I enact my plan to ensure my complete safety. Oh, 900 hours. Summoned George and demanded that every piece of furniture in the building be brought to the top floor and formed into a suitable barricade. A thousand hours. Have dusted off and sharpened my grandfather's sword. Boyhood fencing lessons will surely make me a formidable foe to any kidnappers or murderers. Eleven hundred hours. Have sent George to acquire everything he can in the way of offensive weaponry. Twelve hundred hours. George returned. He's bought some incendiary crystals and clockwork mines. Sent about again for tea and cucumber sandwiches. Thirteen hundred hours. Feel most invigorated. Proper intake of nutrition is vital if I'm to stay alert for murderers. Fourteen hundred hours. Feel rather bloated. Summon George for more tea. <laughs> Fifteen hundred hours. Fell asleep. Unacceptable in the face of potential interlopers. Tomorrow I must eat less bread. Sixteen hundred hours. Sent George to bring me more intimidating clothing. Seventeen hundred hours. The only thing George could find was a black hood. Who else suffice? Eighteen hundred hours. Set up one of the mines ready for the night's vigil. Summon George to pretend to be a kidnapper come to get me. His efforts were most half-hearted. Have dismissed him for now. Nineteen hundred hours. Require the toilet. Have not yet learned how to disarm the mines. George not answering summons. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> this guy is brilliant, I might say. Oh, no, it's just, it's not even a real proper chest. Doesn't have boobs on it. Hey, I didn't say nothing, man, I just copy-pasted. But okay, that was fun. But now that I'm all done, nauseate. I think I'll buy a crate. Macaroni maniac. <laughs> a cheddar cheese heart attack. This is the song episode. Hey, guys. Watch me sing! A bird on a wire. Thank you. That was some kind of mean-spirited joke. I like the moss and or mold on the roof there. That's actually cool looking. Oh. Ooh, yeah. So, is there anything new I gotta do? Well, I gotta go back and look at the, the alehouse floppy bar. Pancake kid shooting the gun. Wakey wakey. Did someone call for me? No, well, that's too bad. Style place. Oh. Oh. It's right. Dark doesn't exist. Yes, yeah, so I gotta go back there and look upwards on some ledges. But first, I gotta explore this place to make sure I know what the hours are. Ooh, looks like I've been here already. How incredible. <laughs> well, well, that's extremely well hidden gambling paraphernalia there. Better grinch up the wagon and no one will know. Work hours, work hours, work hours. Maybe some sort of schedule is posted like, I shall do the builder's work from time to time. <laughs> but, but ho, oh, I definitely need to explore the bottom floor. Perhaps the work hours will be posted in yonder crap house through in the through the colloquial disgustingly modern phrase that will not be tolerated in this house of the uh, of the builder the, who never has to use the bathroom and so neither should we I think we're taking this be like god thing a little too seriously and literally yeah. right so Jumped on the stuff on that side. Can I jump onto something on this side, however? Yes, le question. Maybe. Wait. I <laughs> thought I was a goner there. Hmm. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure I can't do it straight from here, but. Hmm. Is that. Because if that ain't wood, then how the goddamn hell are you supposed to. Like, that, that's definitely not. Yeah. Yeah. Wait. Is that just food? Oh, it's just food. But who puts food there? That's suspicious. I wonder if it's an Easter egg. Hmm. I'll remember you. Oh, but wait. I see how you're probably supposed to do it. Ah! But, you know, kind of like that, you get a general idea. <sighs> All right. None of these look openable to me, but... Yeah, food. It's just food, but suspicious. Maybe I'll find a nest up here. It's it's just food. Weird. I wonder... Maybe it's to lure my eye over here so that I try to get over and find a nest. I don't know, man. Seriously. Man, that is so weird. Why, why make what is a cool secret-looking place and it's just a loaf and some apples? Maybe they're special. Maybe they're special. Okay, well, I may not be done with the exploration yet, though. You know, we still got this. Ooh. Wow. Okay. And apparently that whole beam shenanigan was not even intended. So freaking awesome. Hey, 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 it's Thief. Ah, yes, you see, it led me to more lucrative lucre. Man. Old man, please, Simo. I don't fancy my chances on that roof, but... <laughs> oh, well. Yeah, this is gonna lead me back to the bar. Ooh. What have we here? A crate maze? <laughs> How dare you, sir? <laughs> well, awesome. Yeah, you got some rooftop action, you got some sewer top action, you got some street middle action. Uh, wait a minute. Yes, thank you. Oh, 
awesome. Oh, never seen this kind of weirdy old looking chest before. Gas arrow. Sweet. Placing that one I used. Damn. Okay. Quick check back up here to make sure I ain't. To make sure I ain't. See? 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 All right. What have we now? Oh, this is approximately where I'm wanting to go. <laughs> oh boy, but instead, I'll go here first. Cause, oh, this mission's got the incredible climbing action. <laughs> yeah. All right, loot and a rope arrow. The rope arrow itself is not valuable in any way whatsoever. What are you talking about? Okay. All right, I guess that ain't nothing. Whoa. I thought I was a goner again there. Yeah, this roof is... Whoa, that's amazing. This roof is, I guess, really seriously like, Yo, buddy. Don't go here, man. So, okay. Sh oh, this is... Okay. Should be, at some point, encountering the owner of this dang old place. If I continue in this sort of direction... Also, I guess I could probably go into one of those windows to search room number dead. All right. Oh, yeah, and here we go. Trillion's finest spiced rum. For yeah. Half the shop's behind on rent. I can see why. What with the murders and curfew, the usual glut of sales around carnival time has been quite lacklustre. I can't go giving everyone an advance or I'll be out of business. Perhaps I can find Patrick every time he leaves the shutter open. <laughs> yes. yes. Hint, hint. Some guy left the shutter open. <laughs> like you may not have seen that before, but hey, whatever. Oh, I love these thin little ledges. So much better than hot air balloons. Right, and there's the bank. Which I thought I'd No, that's the actual bank, not Not the real estate place. Now, like as not, I probably have to go in there. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot to put this thing in the bell thing. Okay. I got that one. Lord Eldridge. Okay, uh. Right, so that one and that one I got. That's the real estate agent by the front. Lord Eldridge. I don't know who that is. Could be that guy in there for all I know. I don't know. Oh, whoa, yeah, this is terrifyingly new and scary. I'm gonna stay at home in my mom's basement and not go over there. But okay. Should... Then try to get over to... Hey, what is all this amazing... Like, what, these baskets and everything? Damn, can I actually, can I actually, like, do this? Not really. But I could probably climb up there from the street. Okay, now, how the hell... Oh, I see. Amazing. I love this. Okay, so. Climbing up supreme. Don't know which of these windows precisely I can get in. Maybe all of them, maybe one of them. <laughs> Maybe none of them. Also, there's none on that side. <laughs> anyway, so if I want to get up there, it's like jump on the baskets. Credit sense. Okay. Whoa. Oh, okay. Well, I can get in here, so no problem. Jesus. Oh. <laughs> hey. What? Well, hey there, madam. I just barged into your room. Extremely erotic, I'm sure. What's a big fella like you doing in here at night? <laughs> um, nothing, nothing. Just, you know, come to steal your... There's there's nothing, because honestly, what sort of intelligent uh, lady keeps her valuables out of the open for men to just barge right into? And that's funny, though. <laughs> I feel a bit, uh, I feel this strange sensation I've never felt before. What is it? <laughs> but seriously. Well, here's the murder room, because obviously she's like right... Well, I guess it was locked, so fair enough. But, you know, hey. Okay, yeah, fair enough, it was locked. Ugh, that's... Ugh. 
So I'm supposed to search the room, I suppose, is what I'm supposed to do. Uh, I found a coin. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Receipt for a murder. <laughs> what is this? High Market Museum. Receipt of payment for acquired antiquities. Item 1, antique book. Condition good. Payment received 200 gold. Date September 23rd, 1483. Signed. Somebody, but not quite on the right line there. Oh. Evan Balfour. Interesting. Okay, so that checks off what? Oh. Oh. This, but this is Albert Spirion, who actually I think this guy might be a, a foreigner, maybe? Maybe I'm wrong, but anyways, okay, search room for clues. Another victim, Evan Balfour. So is it like these two are connected? One of them tried to sell the thing to the other or something? Okay, but Balfour, Balfour's offices at the rear of the High Market Museum, which is... Okay, I'm over there. The bank is... The bank is there. There's castle something. The museum is gonna be... I don't even... I don't even see no museum. Oh, it's that you can barely read. High Market Museum, right there, so... <sighs> the beginning is there, so if I kind of... Right... Okay, then. However, there was a bunch of other windows on this other side. I wonder if I can get into one of these rooms that aren't open. Oh, fair enough. Well, that doesn't open the correct direction. Blue booty, blue booty, blue booty. Yeah, see? I mean, this is just that woman, I guess. However, there's that far one over there. <coughs> Which I think, no, this is just the second. Far one doesn't have one at all. Fair enough! God, there's so many places I could go. Ain't isn't there. In fact, can I even get back to the beginning through the river? Probably, but... Might as well give it a try. Gonna be the slowest route, and probably pointlessly so, cause I can pro... But no, cause... But no! I don't know. See you at the beginning. Oh yeah, I ain't get- Wait a minute! Wait a minute, though! I am. Awesome. Alright, you know what? Never mind that. I'll- I'll go along the streets or the roofs or friggin' whatnots and... When I end up, I'll end up. But until then... Oh yeah, that's right. I was told to try climbing over this wall. <gasps> oh ye. Freaking great. This is also nostalgiaing up the place. Uh-huh. So I'm supposed to dig. Am I? <laughs> oh man. I'll make sure not to stand on top of the coffin this time. Unless, of course, it's something other than a coffin. Which... Yeah, it's exactly like that. It's exactly the same deal as uh, King Abaddon's tomb, except rather longer going. Perhaps there's an entire lost city around here. Also, how are you flinging that dirt up? Yes, I won't stand on it this time, unless I will because... Can you? Oh, you can, okay. <laughs> I guess my wailing was heard. Kresmir! So you finally had a tiny jolt of intelligence spark into your fat head and decided to dig up my grave. As you can see, I'm not in it. In fact, I'm alive and well, far away and enjoying your money. I would tell you which of your men betrayed you for a pitiful small sum, I should add, but I think it would be more fun to leave you guessing. As a token of my appreciation for your unceasing idiocy, I've left you that odd stone mask you were so keen to get hold of. I presume you wanted it to make your bloated horse of a wife look more bearable. Sully. <laughs> oh. Uh, I don't see a mask in here, but oh, there is. Awesome puzzle items. Oh, ye. I was thinking I would have to go pretty far to use that shovel, but... Hey, I guess not. Friggin' sweet. Well, having done that, I think I'm gonna leave it here and think about what I've done. Thinking about it. I'll see you guys next time. And bye for now.